here's what I love. It, it's a twist on a bob. Okay. Everyone loves a bob. A bob is classic. It's really, really wearable. So what I love with this is a couple of things. Okay. First of all, it's super lightweight. So if you haven't worn wigs before, if you want to experiment, really important to have it lightweight. The lace front is incredibly important because it makes the hairline look really, really natural. So that's really important okay. as well. And what I love about this, it's taking a classic bob and it's making it fun. Lots of layers in there, lots of volume. You can wear it a lot of different ways. So you can flatten it down, you can put volume in it, you can aerate it out and your hair always looks fabulous. And that to me is what wigs are amazing for. Everyone has a good hair day every day. Well, let's go ahead and walk sure. over to the girls so you can see what this one looks like. While we do that, we want to put a shade chart up and I'm just going to go ahead and walk you through darkest to lightest. But keep in mind that you just want to pick whatever's closest to your hair color unless you want to do something a little bit more fun and do risque. I went natural tonight and Tabitha has created kind of a blend of colors so it'll be the perfect match for you. There's black, there's dark brown, dark auburn, medium brown gold, bright auburn, light golden brown, dark golden blonde, light golden blonde, red blonde, and then your signature color, platinum. Of course. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go right to before and after, and we're looking at Miss Judy. So, you know, kind of describe Judy's hair in that before, because some gals might be seeing their own hairstyle in that before picture. Absolutely. Judy has not a lot of body in her hair. Okay. It is definitely flatter and a little thinner through the top area, which is what a lot of women have, a lot of women struggle with. So here are the issues. Humidity gets you, change of climate gets you, sometimes putting all the product in and the back combing and styling the hair, it's a lot of work. Age changes your hair texture. Age changes your hair Life texture. Changes Children your hair texture. change your hair. <laughs> Everything really yes. affects women to change the hair texture. So not only is this look amazing on Judy, I can't get over it. I just keep <laughs> staring at her and going, oh my God, you look so fabulous. So instantly we've added length. We've got the layers in here. We've got this great fringe that sweeps across. It looks natural. The color is beautiful. It's very similar to Judy's color. Yes, and Judy, she has you know her which color you're wearing? It's the red blonde. The red blonde. So if you have Judy-like hair, you're a red blonde. And here, you know, look how amazing these highlights are. Natural hair, we all know, has many different colors working through yes. it. That's what makes it look so healthy and vibrant and shiny and gorgeous. That's what I wanted to recreate with this. So you see all the different tones working through the hair. It keeps it really natural. And the shape is just universal. This is such a great shape that anyone could put it on and work with that. And as I said, look, yeah. I have it on. I I love, this is my alter ego. I love that you ego. shake it, that you look, move it. I mean, this me, is I'm putting mine behind my ear. You, they're not going to fall off your head. I think that might be a concern sometimes when people wear wigs. Am I going to lose it? No, Absolute, it's on there. Look, you know <laughs> what? It's, it's not precious. It really yeah. isn't precious. You can just play with it. You can get caught in the wind. You can shake your head. You can do all the things that you want to do and that you would do to your hair, including if you want to change the style yeah. a little bit. Every time you shake so, your hair, it looks But look, amazing. you can like amp this out. Oh, I look so rock and roll. No, well, I love it. Look at this. Can you put um, hair putties, hairspray, hair creams? Sure, you can use products in here. What you want to do is layer them in lightly, just like you would with your hair. Okay. And you don't need to use them all the time because remember, with your hair, if it's finer, it's going to react not only to the environment, but it's going to be weighed down with the product. Okay. You're also going to get that stickiness in your hair as well. So you're not having to cleanse a wig all the time, but yes. you can definitely put some products in there so you know if you want to get a little bit more volume and look like a rock and roll chick like I do you right do now it. which I love you can do that awesome well I'm gonna just give Judy a 360 and then we're gonna move to Stacy oh I'm gonna turn you the other way I'm sorry I'm making you dizzy Miss Judy aren't I but we want you to see this is the side difference so what's nice about a wig is if you are someone with thinning hair or hair loss or you just want more confidence in the hair department looks great in the front yeah. but looks great in the side and if you want to do a, a back view will we do a yep and then we'll Give you that wonderful and look, view from look the back. how beautiful this is so it moves which is really important as judy you know would walk around yes. and live her life the hair is going to move just like your natural hair is going to move and the profile is absolutely beautiful Stunning. and the shape is That's great because there's a lot of hair there but it's nicely layered and textured so that you can get that movement which we all want yes all right so this is stacy i'm going to tell you this is going to be the most confusing <laughs> show i have ever done because i know these girls but now i have to be like this is let me look at your I know. eyes stacy. i know <laughs> look at her she looks dynamite this 
Again, look how universally flattering this shape is. Yes. It's such a great shape. It works for so many different face wow. shapes. And it's really a great length because especially if you're someone that has shorter hair like I do yeah. and like Judy does and like Stacy does, you want that little bit of length but you don't want to feel overpowered with hair. Sometimes growing your hair out it can feel a little overpowering. Yes. This is such a great length. And it's, again, it's just got this perfect texture in there that I love. It's beautiful. Stace, I'm going to turn you towards me, if okay. you don't mind, so we can get that uh, profile again. And what I love about this is, again, it's $119, but Tabitha is known not just, you know, for her wonderful personality, but for her hair expertise. And so you really did the highest quality wigs that you could find and yet keep a wonderful value. That lace front, it means a lot to people who shop for wigs. You know what? It means a lot to people. What I really wanted was something that was just so incredibly comfortable for everyone to wear so I want people to feel comfortable I want people to have a great hair day every day yeah. because a lot of women don't have great hair days every day myself included and we struggle so I want something that you can put it on you don't need to worry about the weather you don't need to worry about how you look because you're going to look fabulous but I want it to be comfortable so the lace front is really important the fiber that I have my Carillon light is really amazing it's shiny it moves it's textured, looks, feels, and acts like real hair, which is what I love. Well, we want to okay. go to that shade chart again. So we black, have to. dark brown, dark auburn, medium brown gold, bright auburn, light golden brown, dark golden blonde, light golden blonde, red blonde, and then Tabitha's signature real hair color, the platinum. <laughs> and I will let you know, too, uh, uh, we do have some gray options coming up in the future in this hour, so stay with us if you are a gray hair girl. I think Tabitha really knocked out of the part when she chose to do the gray. And Dan, you said one of the colors was getting limited. The red blonde that Judy mm. was wearing tonight, or is wearing tonight, color. is getting limited. So here's Colleen. <laughs> I know, it really is Colleen. Everyone looks so different. It is, I love it. And again, look, that's what hair is all about. Hair is so transformative and it changes us so much, not just our attitude, how we look. And that's what's so great about being able to put on a wig. You can take on a different persona. You can have the hair you always wanted. You can try something out. You can test drive it. You can play without making that commitment to your real hair, which is important. And I think the confidence factor just happens to come every time you're going to put this wig on. Yeah. Because now you feel like you've got that hair that you had in your 20s, 30s and 40s. A lot of women, they go through changes where their hair just isn't the same texture, it isn't the same thickness, and you know, maybe you don't wear it every single day, maybe you wear it on that Saturday night dinner, that wedding invite, or because every day matters to you, it's so easy, you go ahead and rock mm -hmm. it seven days a week. Yeah. And that was Colleen kind of doing a whole 360. And this color is gorgeous as it well. Is. And you know what, what wigs are also are great. Dark auburn. Dark auburn. Dark auburn. Wigs are also great because you can try a different color. Yes. And being a professional hairdresser for 30 plus years, <laughs> I know what it's like to have clients in and, and really not like the hair that they were given. And sometimes you can't change that. So giving an alternative like a wig is just such a great thing for women because it takes that unhappiness with your hair away and you can have the hair that you wanted. Well, Tabitha, we're going to walk to Adrian and talk on the phone at the same time because Harriet joins us. Harriet, welcome in. I'm Amy, but please meet Tabitha. Hi. Hi, I'm delighted to meet both of you. Oh, thank, thank you, you, Harriet. We feel the same way. Um, Harriet, we want to know, did you purchase the very first wig from the show? I did for a different reason from what you're talking about for the most part. I, um, even though I'm a, a lady of a certain age, I have always had thick hair, mm -hmm. still have thick hair. It's coarse, it's naturally curly, and it drives me crazy. So uh. I cut it very short and want it to grow out. And I can't let it grow out because I can't stand looking at it as it does. <laughs> so I, <laughs> I bought this wig so that I can still have good hair days and let my natural hair grow out. Oh, I good. I love that. And listen, a short-haired girl like me, I know the pains of growing your hair out. It can be <laughs> so disastrous. Is it years in the making? <laughs> oh, it's years and you go through those terrible patches of hating yourself and hating your hair and wanting to cut it off. This is such a great way to be able to do it. You're going to love it. I know you are. And when, especially because you have that natural texture in your hair, it's a really humid day, you are going to be so thankful, Harriet. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. I I'm 
I'm going to be a whole new woman. I've lost 117 pounds. Oh, my gosh, Right, Harriet. congratulations. Uh -huh. And so now I'm letting my hair grow. I'm a whole new woman. You, I love you, that. Your voice sounds incredible, I love so that. I can hear the happiness. Yes. Well, Harriet, nice to meet you tonight, and you'll look beautiful in the wig. And thank you, girls. Keep up the good work. You're oh, doing a great thank job. You. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you, Harriet. Okay, thank you so much. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> well, whatever shade, we want to end on that shade chart so that you can make your decision. You know, Harriet's doing it because she's done with that curly hair and watching it grow out. Maybe your hair won't grow for you anymore. Maybe you just want to change and lighten up the look a little bit. But here's your shades. I say if you've never worn a wig, start with the one that looks most like your real head. Black, dark, dark brown dark auburn, medium brown gold, bright auburn, light golden brown, dark golden blonde, light golden blonde, red blonde, or platinum. Okay, the bob that I am wearing is very popular tonight. It was my favorite two girls. We have the same taste. I'm just a bob girl. What can I say, Tabitha? I'm a bob girl. Me too. I love them. They're fabulous. <laughs> and this one really is the perfect title. It's sleek. It's the sleek bob. Um, it is right under...